So we're going to be opening up two boxes of Circuit Break Special Edition. So recently in the market watches and everything like that, uh, people have been saying that uh, Sphere Mode is now uh, rising in price. As a result, I wanted to actually get them, uh, hopefully in the Special Editions, uh, before they actually, like, you know, become insane prices. And it's great that I still actually can buy uh, Circuit Break Special Edition. So I figured they would stop selling this already, but um, they still do. So I'm just going to open two of these and hopefully we can get Sphere Mode. Uh, because they pretty much make up for the entire box here. Uh, one of these boxes go for about 15 each. And Sphere Mode currently goes for about 18. So overall, we're making a lot of money out of that. Uh, unfortunately, we got Stardust Chronicle, which is not the card we want. Uh, though, let's actually see what we get inside it. Alright, so the other one is, yeah, Lockout Gardener. So it's not the one we want. Uh, we have three packs here, but let's open the other one as well. And hopefully we can get Sphere Mode. Alright. A little bit difficult. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't get it, so that's too bad. Um, but either way, we get uh, six packs of uh, Circuit Break here to open up. And uh, I'm still looking for Borolo Dragon, so hopefully I can get it. Alright, let's get started with the first pack. Okay, so first pack we have Ranvir. Uh, Amazonas Pet Liger, Defect Compiler, The Accumulator, uh, Backup Squad, and X Crawler Quaylark, so nothing there. Uh, Axon, some more crawler stuff, so that's great. Uh, but obviously, we're looking for Borolo Dragon or Evenly Matched. So, next pack uh, Gogi Headbat, uh, World Legacy Clash, Metaphyst Daedalus, nice, and a Behemoth Fiendus, unfortunately. Uh, nothing there as well. I am expecting something, so hopefully we can get like a secret or something as well. I am looking for squib draw and uh, also quick, uh, quick something, quick launch. Uh, basically, they're rocket cards that I still need, and they're both secrets in this set, so hopefully I can get it. Ah, uh, oh dear, an overdone burial. That's one of the cards I really didn't want to pull. Uh, it's still a secret, so can't complain. Um, interestingly enough, uh, Overdone Burial is actually starting to get more popular in Zombies, so if you're playing Zombies, definitely give this card a try. Uh, it's a really good card there. But that's one secret, so let's open up the other three packs. Uh, Spine, Mermails, Amazonas, uh, Metaphys Tyrant Dragon, and... A Metaphys Nephthy, so unfortunately nothing there still. Uh, let's continue on. We have two more packs left, so hopefully we can get something cool. Alright, some Crawlers, World Legacy Pawns, uh, FAs, Gokies again, Fantastic Stryborg, not bad, and an Altergeist Protocol. Alright, well, Altergeist are still meta, so always an interesting card to have. Uh, last pack of Destiny, so let's just see what we can get in this. Uh, Crawler Spine, Duck Dummy, the Accumulator, Vendred Reunion, so not bad at all, and... Yes! Alright, we got evenly matched. That's awesome. So this is a secret. Um, you guys can tell I'm currently kind of whispering because uh, there are people at home, so I'm trying to keep my voice down. But yes, we got evenly matched. That's awesome. I think this card makes up for both the boxes we just pulled. Um, and we also got Overdone Burial as well, so oh my god, that's amazing. That's really great. Yeah, alright. So overall, pretty nice box. Um... I really didn't expect that, but an evenly matched. Sadly, we couldn't get Ra, uh, but that's not a big deal considering we got evenly matched here. So, yeah, I'm definitely going to go and get more boxes of these. Uh, this is definitely really good, but uh, just wanted to make this really quick video here. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video and hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you next time.